Okay, so today we find ourselves back at a location we dove a little over a year ago. Today we're creating an underwater video and we're going to create an underwater video and some still photography on the shipwreck known as the Luckport. Now the Luckport is a vessel that uh, caught fire and burnt down uh, to the hull. Uh, I think it was 1926, but it could have been 1936. I should review my notes on that and make sure I have that information. But it did it right here in Georgian Bay, right up at the top of the uh, peninsula of Penetanguishen, next to Awenda Park. We're gonna be using today my Canon 550D, situated in a Mekong housing, I'm using a GoPro Hero 3 Black with a filter for green water for my video. I have one um, MXD1 strobe and I'm using my two Archon A6 uh, video lights. So that's the gear that we're going to use today. Now, just a little story, just a little footnote. This is actually the third time we have come to shoot this video over the last month. The first time we came here, I messed up royally with the still images. When I set my camera inside my uh, camera housing, I have to have the focus on the lens set to automatic. I have no way of uh, reaching it after um, I have put it in the housing. I have no way of setting the focus, but I didn't do that. I shot this, these, all the still images I shot with my lens set to manual focus. I came back a second time about two weeks after that and I reshot all the stills, this time with the camera set correctly. And we got some nice stills and we are going to see those stills today at the end of today's video. But somewhere along the line, I deleted all the video footage that I collected from the first dive. So hey, take three, we are back here today, now a month later, to dive the look port again and hopefully Today, we're going to get it right. Gary here with Gary Clayton Photography. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Let's gear up, let's head down to the water, let's start this dive, and let's see if today we can get this job accomplished. We'll talk to you soon. Now, there is quite a lengthy little trail uh, to get down to the rock area of the beach um, or the rocks of the beach where we can actually get in the water or the entry site to this particular dive. And this is a trail we head down. Um, it's a, uh, I believe it's called the Sunset Trail and it is between a few homes um, so we don't want to disturb anybody but I just thought we'd run a little bit of footage of the trail taking us down to this rocky beach where we're going to make our entry and exit uh, for this particular Pretty dive. Pretty in here, a lot of bugs of course, mosquitoes, <laughs> even in the bright sunshine once you get into the woods and it gets uh, uh, shady, the mosquitoes are horrendous, black flies, all the kind of northern uh, bugs that bite. But. It is what we have to do if we want to get uh, to the dive site today. Along this trail we come to this little bridge over this creek, kind of nice. Keep going. And this is going to take us out to the water. Georgian Bay, Lake Huron. 
a beautiful place to be on a summer's day like today. There'll be boats out there. I can hear boats in the distance. A giant's Tomb Island across the way. Absolutely gorgeous. An amazing location to be, an amazing location to dive, and an amazing location to photograph. Over to our left, it's Christian Island. Christian Island is a First Nation reserve here in Ontario. You can get a ferry across there, and just for a point of interest, if you ever get the chance to go over there, I had the best bacon, lettuce, and tomato on a toasted Kaiser bun I've ever had. Right over there at Christian Island. Absolutely perfect.
So, we made it back from the dive. It was an uneventful dive. It was interesting, easy going, no problem kind of dive. Uh, and that's exactly the way I like it. Um, underwater photography has its challenges. Um, taking cameras into essentially a hostile environment, which underwater is for electronics of any kind, has got its challenges. And we constantly have uh, technical difficulties, uh, problems like, as I said earlier, uh, this is the third time I've tried to shoot this particular video. Today, I think, uh, is a success. And that's great. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to set up and I'm going to shoot a time lapse from the beach because it really is pretty here. Um, I'm also going to pop up the drone. Uh, today I've got uh, my Unique Breeze with me, uh, which is a drone that I did replace, by the way. But anyhow, I've got the Unique Breeze with me. We're going to pop that up. We're going to also shoot a time lapse. We're going to relax for a bit. Then we're going to go have a cup of coffee. I hope you've enjoyed today's video. Please like, give me a share, leave a comment. I'll get back to all comments. And please subscribe. Um, I could use all the subscribers I can get. And let's take a look at some stills from today's dive. Talk to you next time. Bye-bye. Thank you.